Hey everyone, welcome to a new executable items tutorial. In this case, I will show you how to create infinite and finite blocks. This item is very easy, so it doesn't need an explanation with documents or presentations. So let's create it. First of all, let's create the item infinite dirt. That will be the example. The material will be dirt, obviously. And let's see what happens with this simple item. When I place it, it's gone. Okay, so to make it infinite, when I place it, another item should be given to myself in the same slot I used it. So, let's do it. When I place it, it's a type of activator, because it's a type of trigger. Let's search it. Player, mm, 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 player block place. That is what we want because it triggers when I am placing a block. So I place it and an item should be given to myself. In player commands we can give it. We are not going to use the vanilla give command because it will give us a vanilla dirt and when place it, it will be gone. We need to give ourselves the same executable item so we're going to use the command ei give slot you can check the parameters in the wiki that i will leave in the description below but in general ideas is ei give slot layer the id that is infinite dirt quantity one and the slot that i will use the placeholder of a slot so the item will be given in the same slot, I am using the item. And that's it. Finish, save, save. And when I place it now, an item is given to myself. Okay, so that's all. The, we have an infinite block. If you see that sometimes, like it is, it got bugs because of the of the chatter I am using. Now, it is infinite. What if we would like it to be finite? For example, you can place 200 blocks. Okay, first we have to set the usage to 200, the amount of we want the item to be placed. Let's see what happens if it is in 200. When I place it, the item is given to myself with the same usage, 200. So, we have to add a parameter in the command we added. A slot, and this parameter is the usage. We are going to give the item with the usage that has right now, minus 1. Okay. So, when I place it now, it will give myself the same item, but with one usage decreasing the actual usage. So it is decreasing, it is working perfectly. I will set the usage to 10 just for testing purposes. Let's place it 10 times and 1, 0 and it give myself the item again okay that's that's because we have to add a condition the condition is that this command and this activator itself will only run if the usage item condition usage is greater than one okay and with the error message will be null and let's save so the usage is greater than one when i place the block another block will be given to myself okay still greater than one greater than one greater and now it's not greater than one so when i place it no i no block will be given to myself and that's it now instead of 10 you can set it to 1000 for example and you can 
place it 1000 times, when it reaches zero, the block will be gone. Now, that's the general method where you can create infinite blocks, but it has one exception. That is working with blocks or with items that place blocks that doesn't get removed from your hand. What do I mean? The water bucket. If we set this material to water bucket, let's see. In mode survival, I will place it and nothing happens, okay? Because of a lot of things. First of all, player block place is not being triggered because placing water is not placing a block so when working with buckets you don't need it you have to add an activator right clicking and block okay so when i right click a block i will say water placed just for debugging let's check now water placed okay Wait. Water place it. So it works perfectly. If I click the air, nothing happens because I set it to only work when clicking blocks. Now, when I place the block, what should happen? When I place the water, I mean, I will place it and the bucket will be removed from my inventory and a water bucket should be given to myself with the usage actual minus one. So let's see. Yeah, I show when placing it first, the item in my hand should get removed. How are we going to use it? Using this command execute run item replace entity bike. Weapon main hand with air and instead of bike, liar. So, what will happen now if I place it? It is the book, the bucket is removed as well. I place it, removed, removed. That's what we are going that's what we are doing with this command now let's give ourselves the item that's something we already did before that is using the command ei give slot layer infinite the earth one a slot usage minus one let's save and it is 1000 999 and that's all now you have infinite water that you can place it many times as you want let's set the usage to 10 just for check what happens usage to 10 and let's place it 10 times 3 2 1 and zero and it doesn't disappear why because of the same we did before we have to add the condition that this activator will only work when the usage is greater than one no message and uh, let's save now 10 8 7 6 Five, four, three, two, one, and no more water. That's the whole tutorial. I hope you understood. We learned how to create infinite blocks, how you can set it to finite blocks, like an amount of blocks you can place. Um, there, there is one exception related to water and we learned how to how to work with them 
I hope you like it and if you have any question feel free to ask them. See you.